Good morning, welcome to art. Um, today we're gonna be creating an art passport. Before I show you what that looks like, let's look at what a real passport looks like. So a real passport is a government document that you would use to travel, this is a travel passport, outside of the country, so outside of the United States. So this is a passport, and the reason we're doing this in art is because this year we're going to be creating a lot of art from different countries and learning about different places and different people all over the world. You need to start with a piece of construction paper. It should look like this. When you get the construction paper, I want you to fold it in half. This is called hamburger fold, just like you're making a card for someone. So fold it in half, make a crease, so you're creasing it, okay, and it should look like that. Try to line. Next, you want to pick up your large piece of white paper and fold this in half, hot dog style. So that is long ways. Take the paper. The easiest way to do this is to start in the middle. Okay, take your fingers and pinch it in the middle, and then I want you to pinch the other side. It's easier to do this if it's down on the table. Okay, so I can kind of show you in my little space here. But you want to go across, try to line up the edges, line up the edges first, and then make the crease. A little bit harder to do if you pinch it. It's a little easier. It's a bigger piece of paper, so it's a little tricky. It doesn't have to be perfect. Just do the best you can. If you're not great at folding paper, help a friend next to you. Okay. And there you go. So you should have something that looks like a giant card like that. After you do that, I want you to take this, okay, the opening is on the bottom, that's important for later, and I want you to fold it in half again. This is a little tricky. Fold it in half so the edges meet, so the corners meet, and then I want you to crease it again, and crease it again. There you go. Alright, after you do that, you're going to open it up, okay, set it on the table, so it looks like a mountain, <laughs> just like this, okay? And then set it down. Take one of the sides, fold it in to the middle. So you're making another fold. If your paper gets stuck, just kind of gently pull it over. And then you're going to fold it again. So you're creating another fold on your paper, another section. Next, use the other side. Fold that over and crease. There you go. So crease that side too. So now you should have one, two, three, four sections, and you should be able, let me put this up so you can see me. Um, you should be able, this is called an accordion fold. So you should be able to open and close it, okay, like that. And then when you set it down on the table, let's go ahead and set it down so it looks like a little W. Okay, after you have that, we're going to glue this inside of the cover. So for the cover, again, we have this, okay? This is the only part that gets like a little bit tricky, so pay attention, okay? So the way we open a book, we open it to the right, right? So we have the front cover. Let me show you my finished one because it will make more sense if you can see the one that's done. Um, so I have my front cover that I'm still working on adding artwork to. I have the inside of my front cover that has my little caricature of my face. I have some information about things that I like. And then this is kind of cool because this folds out. So it looks like this little thing. Now when we glue this white paper into here, we want to make sure that the bottom is open. And there's a reason for that because as long as it doesn't stick, oh, I gotta open it all the way. That would help. We can open it back up all the way and we're gonna draw all kinds of cool stuff in there. How cool is that? So we're gonna fold this back up and then the whole thing closes and it's just like this little book. So this is gonna be kind of like our little um, global art sketchbook this year. So what I'd like you to do is take this and this. So you have these two parts. Everybody with me? Good. And now I need you to get some glue. Okay, we are going to be using squeeze glue. Don't use too much. Your whole book will glue together. Don't do that. Don't be that person. Okay? Open up your cover and lay it flat. 
okay? Next, you're going to take your folded part. You're going to make sure that the opening is on the bottom, okay? What am I, what am I talking about, the opening? The opening of the white paper, see what opens? See that? Okay, so that's gonna go near the bottom. So on the back, so I'm gonna fold it up, and then on the back of the white paper, I'm just gonna put glue all over the back. So go ahead and open that up. This is brand new glue, so you shouldn't have to like, you know, be too aggressive with it. And you guys are a little older than my primary kiddos, so I think you can handle it. See, I got about that much, not, not too crazy. So then go ahead and flip it over. So again, you're putting this on the right side, the right side, okay? The right, your right. <laughs> and go ahead and just press that down. Um, if you put too much glue, maybe grab a paper towel, ask to grab a paper towel in a minute, um, but it shouldn't like be leaking out the sides, okay? And you should be able to open this, move back a little bit, you should be able to open and close your book. So you should kind of be able, so it's like an accordion fold. So this is your goal for today. This is what I would like you to get done. We're not gonna finish the cover today. We're not gonna do the inside. If you get done early, what you can do is you can start writing things about yourself on the inside cover near the top. Um, I definitely want you to write your name no matter what step you're at. So when you finish today, I need you to take your book and take a black marker. You should have a black marker in your art box, I believe, on your table. And I want you to write name. This is actually all I want you to write on the inside. So, because I think this is gonna take the whole class. I want you to write name at the top. I'll flip it over in a sec so you can see it. My name is Mrs. Scheutzo. I want you to write your, your first and last name on the inside of the front cover, okay? And then when you're done, put everything back in the bin and clean up. And I will see you the next time you have art. Nice job.